The People's Liberation Army has been executing night flight drills under bad weather. The Army has also announced that, starting last Friday, military exercises are to be operated till Sunday, further displaying their aggression towards invading Taiwan. So According to Chinese media, the military drills recently are ran to warn Taiwan, especially since the U.S., has been showing much attention to Taiwan recently, and analysts from CNN thinks that the current Russo-Ukrainian war did not become a stopping factor for China to invade Taiwan. Instead, it became a catalyst for speeding up future aggression. And according to U.S. officials I talked to, Xi Jinping is going to do, if he does invade Taiwan, he's going to be much better at it. In other words, he's going to go quicker, and he's going to be even more brutal and more devastating, and he's going to make sure that he gets that uh, capital city before they have a chance to rally the international community to defend them, and he's going to know what our economic playbook is, and he's going to fight the information war better than Putin. In 2027, the target goal in the first stage of the war is to have a strong military force in the South Taiwan region. As the threats from the People's Liberation Army continued, ROCA will be initiating missile drills near the sea at Taitung, facing the ever-increasing aggressions from China. Taiwan stays prepared for incoming threats. TVBS English News.